Welcome back to my channel. Today we have a haul. Today I have a couple items from a brand called, I believe it's Sunkey, Sunkey, it's spelled S-O-N-C-Y. So the first item I have is these shorts and they are so adorable. I don't, can you see that? Yeah. It's like a faux leather and brown and yellow closer so you can see the actual color. So adorable for summer or fall, really. So that's the first one. Okay, so the next outfit is this beautiful denim dress. Has like a little, um, what do you call it? Peak hole right here. You actually can wear these straps on the shoulder or off. I prefer off. What do you guys think? Outfit number two. Okay, so this outfit is really, really cute, but unfortunately, I think it's a little too big. The straps need to be um, altered. So I'm gonna get it altered, but this is a really, really cute outfit dress. Okay, it has like a little ooh, slit on the side. Super adorable. What do you guys think? I like it. Outfit. Okay. I like this dress. I bought it because it looks like super vintage. It fits wonderfully. It is blue with black pinstripes. It has like a little reflective look to it it also has a slit in the front really really cute what do you guys think my camera actually cut out on the last outfit but this is outfit number five and i like it it's really cute it is it goes past let's see i can do this it goes past my knees. It has like a keyhole here. I guess that's just one keyhole. It has these ties. Don't mind that. I just tied it really quick. But really cute. I like it. Probably my favorite one. Let me know what you think. Outfit number five. Okay, so the next three items I'm not going to be able to try on uh, for various reasons, but this is super cute. I bought a swimsuit. It is white with a marbled coloring, watermark, marbling. I don't know what it is, but it's really cute, but um, it's V-cut, so pretty much everything is out, so I'm not going to try it on, but it does fit. Um, and then the top is really cute. This one actually attracted me to this swimsuit. It is a little off the shoulder. Very sexy. The bottom is actually high waist. I don't know if I mentioned that. It's really, really cute. Love it. It accentuates all your curves. So I definitely recommend that. I definitely recommend number six. Um, and probably number five, this cute little dress I have on right now. Now, I bought a couple more items, but they don't fit. So, I'm just going to show it to you because I still think they're really cute. So, number seven is this. I'll try to insert a picture as well. But it's this really cute vintage polka dot looking dress with these ruffles. What I really like is it has the ruched side just like that burgundy one I tried on really cute I bought it in a size double zero which is the equivalent to uh, I believe like a size 10 and it's just too small so I, I probably would say this runs really really small if you have either hips uh booty uh yeah I would go up two sizes so I'm probably gonna put this on my Poshmark but still Thought I should mention it because it's really, really cute. And the last item I actually bought for work. And it is sort of like a jumpsuit situation. 
This also had like the vintage look. I would say like Palazzo pants, has the wide leg, we get close so you can see that detail. It has orange, brown, white, and white pinstripes. It has three buttons on the front. Sort of like an overall type look. I could not get it zipped. So in this one, I ordered a size zero, zero. I recommend going up at least a size. And as I mentioned before, zero, zero is a size 10. Hey, so it's a day later and I realized that it'll be really cool if I added in 360 videos. So I'm gonna insert those. So if you see a different outfit or a different hairstyle, that's why. Initially, when I first tried on this dress, I thought that it didn't fit. Now, I did get it on, but it's a little bit tighter than I would like it to be um, in this area and especially in the back. And it hits right under my butt. So if I was to wear heels with this, it would be over. So therefore, I would still recommend going up a size rather than two. I think a size is a good, um, a good upsize for this. But let me just get into the 360 view and you make the decision for yourself. So yeah, super short in the back, really tight right here. You make the decision. Overall, I think this was a very successful haul. I want to say I spent around 80 or $81 and it was well worth it. I had two items that didn't fit, but it probably was my fault. I should have played, I should have paid close attention to the um, reviews and the sizing. On the stretchier items, I'm a size zero, 00, which is the equivalent to, I want to say, either a 10 or a 12, somewhere along the lines. I'll list everything down below because I'm not sure at this time. But, yeah, I definitely recommend Sunkey, Sunkey. If you know how to pronounce it, put it down below. Um, but that's the wrap on this video. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Tell me what was your favorite outfit and if you'll be using this brand. So... I hope that you like, comment, and subscribe. We're on the way to 100 subscribers, and we hope that you can get us there. Bye.